Ah, children! Such delightful additions to our everyday lives. They're cute and sweet and learning everything for the first time. And then your kid goes and says something like, Goodbye, Dad, said my two-year-old son. No, we say goodnight. I know, but this time it's goodbye. Daddy, can you cut off someone's tongue without killing them? A mother asked her daughter what she was thinking about and she replied, I'm imagining the waves of blood rushing over me. I caught my daughter saying, die, 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 die. So I ask, what's that you're saying? And she turns to face me and just whispers, die. So I shouldn't throw him in the fire, said my three-year-old daughter while holding her baby brother for the first time. Daddy, remember that time we died? I wait to find my three-year-old standing by my bed, staring at me with a huge grin on his face. What are you doing? I finally say. Nothing, he says, still grinning. At this point I realise he's got his hands behind his back. Are you holding something? No. I look anyway. He's hiding the largest carving knife behind his back. We got my little sister a puppy for Christmas. When she woke up and saw the dog, she said, mm -hmm. My baby, it's not time for you yet, and tried to pick up the dog and shove it in her mouth. We had just moved into a new house and two kids showed up at the door. When I asked if I could help them, one of them said, Our mum wants us to tell you the old people who used to live here are buried at the end of the road. They ran off and I've never seen those kids again to this day. As I was driving down the road, my kid was about to nod off. Right before the lights changed, he said, Last time I died in a fire. <coughs> Mum, I promise I won't ever chew on your bones. I promise. My four-year-old son asked my pregnant sister if there was a baby in her belly. She said yes. With a completely straight face, he slid from his chair and headed for the kitchen, <coughs> saying, We need to get it out. I'll go get the knife. <laughs> My daughter saw me getting dry skin off my shoulder after bad sunburn and asked if she could keep my skin flakes and put them in a jar so when I die she can make a mummy mask to remember me always. My three-year-old daughter stood next to her new baby brother and looked at him for a while, then turned to me and said, Daddy, it's a monster. We should bury it. At my great uncle's funeral, my daughter asked when he was going to turn into a zombie. I was sound asleep and around 6am I was awoken by my four-year-old daughter's face inches from mine. She looked right into my eyes and whispered, I want to peel all your skin off. <coughs> my little cousin drew a picture of a black monster, looked up at me and said, He told me to draw this. He's coming for you. You better hide. My six-year-old son asked my mother to lay down on her stomach, then he sat on her butt and started bouncing up and down and proclaimed, Thanks, Discover Channel! I said, Go back to sleep, there isn't anything under your bed. To which my son replied, You're right, he's behind you now. Daddy, I love you so much that I want to cut off your head and carry it around so I can see your face whenever I want. Did these bizarre quotes creep you out? Comment below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button.